Man, I gotta, I gotta work on this and I need both hands, but all I got is my phone for light and I can't, can't get it propped up anywhere. Now what are we gonna do? Okay guys, so we, we got this at the As Seen on TV store. We got it for 10 bucks, $9.99. It is As Seen on TV. Right there in the back. Now this is a, a trouble light, and I don't have one to compare it to, but remember those ones that they used to call them drop lights, trouble lights? They would hang off something, had a cord, you plug them in, you drop them, they'd burn out. But uh, this thing hangs, it attaches, it stands, it's magnetic. So we're going to see how well this thing is and let's get it opened up. But first, we can try it right here. Yeah, that's, that's, uh, that's pretty bright so far. Now it's not quite dark out yet because it's only like nine minutes after 3 p.m. And, uh, but it is a little dark. I don't know if you can hear in the background, but We got kind of a thunderstorm and some rain and dark clouds going on. I've seen seen a couple guys do these on uh, some YouTube videos and. Uh, they seem to get pretty good reviews, so we seen this, and uh, well, Monkey showed it to me and said, look, here's one of these lights, and I thought, cool, well, let's give it a shot, because I, I've been wanting one anyway, I need one, we're out in the garage, so, okay, you've got your light, very pretty, nice and clean, it won't be like that for long, I mean, it kind of feels, you know, it's, it's all plastic, but, it does have the uh, magnet on it. Yeah. So, there's really not much to review on it, although it does take batteries, but they come in it, so that's good. Uh, I've seen it somewhere where it says requires three AA batteries included. So, it kind of gives you a little, uh, there's your warning on the back. And it just kind of tells you, you know, on off switch, rubberized, which doesn't feel that rubbery to me. Uh, I mean, it's cheap. It's very light. Um, but there's the veil that you lift up and you, you hang off of stuff. And then it flips down. And then, of course, you got your magnet or you can stand it. Stand it up. So it is pretty bright. Uh, so, but it just gives you, it just says getting started, you know, remove the screws from the back and place cover side, install the batteries, but they're already installed. I mean, we all, I think we all know how to change batteries, and it gives you something like that. So, let's just see how well the magnet works, shall we? Okay, we're at the refrigerator. Let's see if it'll stick on this because it's not real smooth, you know. It's got the designs or whatever in it. Ready? Okay, so it should hang off the hood of a car pretty decently. So, I mean, yeah, that's... Uh, let's see if it hangs upside down. Yes, it does. It does hang upside down. So... That's weird. Alexa just uh, tried to say something. I don't know. So. I'm not sure. Huh. See, that's Alexa talking. I'm here by myself, guys. So, there's that. Now, let's take it outside and see how well, how good it looks under the hood of the truck when it's dark. Okay, guys. So, we're out here at the truck. This is the light from my cell phone, which, as you can see, it's pretty good light, but, I mean, all I've got on this cell phone is just a little, can you see it, just a little kickstand there? And, I mean, 
if you got to work on something and you're by yourself what are you going to do you know so that's where this thing might come in handy let's check this out alright so I'm going to shut the light off on my phone alright lights off and there's the light for this now you can see I've noticed that you can see the lines from the guard here this guard I don't want to shine it too much in your face but you can see lines from that but the good thing about this is I can hang it there and I've got plenty of light or put that away and I can go like that and I can get down in to whatever I've got to work on and use both hands to where if I'm using my phone I've only got one hand and I would have to prop it somewhere so that's pretty good if I just want to stand it there and work on something over there I can like right here I can do that I can set this anywhere I want I can uh, put it under there and that gives off a good bit of light I mean that's that's pretty impressive for ten dollars and I've got a hundred dollar <laughs> flashlight you might as well say right here and but you can't hold it right so I mean you know it's it's plenty of light if you have someone to hold it for you but I don't in this case now there's nothing wrong with the truck guys I'm just using this for a scenario but as you can see yeah it's uh you know it's it's pretty bright now the light you see over to the left right now is the porch light but so I'm trying to make it as dark as I can so there you go and uh, let's kind of shine it up inside the truck here You know, so let's turn it off. So there you go. So pretty cool. So I am definitely giving this item right here a two thumbs up. So for ten bucks, I'm I'm going to start buying them because uh, I'd like to put one in the in the toolbox of the truck. I'd like to keep two in the house. I'd like to keep one in my toolbox. One in our little tote that's for our Ginu for when we go boating, and uh, one in our camp and stuff. I mean, for 10 bucks, what the hell, right? And you don't even have to open them because in the package, if you remember, you can open it or turn it on without taking it out of the package. So you can check it every, you know, every few months. Just uh, check it and make sure the batteries are good. That way, it's always ready when you need it. So. Um, so I, I like it guys. I think it's uh I think it's pretty cool. So Ooh, that looks pretty spooky, huh? <laughs> so anyway guys, there we go. How's that? So uh anyway that uh two thumbs up for me, man. If you can get I wouldn't give no more than ten bucks for it. Uh you know, I wouldn't give twelve. But ten dollars is a very fair price. Even cheaper would be better, but ten bucks and comes with the batteries, yeah, that's great. Uh pick you up one or two. Uh, I, I highly recommend it. Uh, so, all right, guys. Thanks for watching. Shea Bear, the Myth Man Legend. I'm gone for now. Bye, bye. Y'all take care now.